What's up guys, my name is Uncage Games. Welcome back to another Injustice 2 video. Today, I want to bring you guys this topic talking about why we haven't seen Green Lantern revealed, why we haven't seen Flash revealed, and a possible new Lantern, new Flash in Injustice 2. The idea to make this video came to mind when I saw the reveal of Jessica Cruz, Green Lantern, and Wally West Flash being playable in the Injustice mobile game. Now, I said this before, but is it me or does the mobile games get more content than the actual console game? It's kind of ridiculous how they keep getting new stuff and we can't get like one little skin for the game but they get like five new characters but that's not the topic of this video the topic is are we gonna get a new Green Lantern and are we gonna get a new Flash now I'm saying this because one we haven't gotten any Green Lantern reveals yet they haven't revealed Hal Jordan or Jon Stewart or any of the Green Lanterns but they did reveal this new Green Lantern in the Injustice mobile game meaning they have a character model for her she has a look she has some somewhat of a unique move set in the game and so does Wally West now they have a character model for him and they have some unique moves for him also the only thing though they don't have unique super moves. Now if you guys don't remember, they revealed Deadshot as a playable character in Injustice Mobile way before they actually revealed the Injustice 2 version of Deadshot. So that's what I'm saying, they could be doing this again, but with Wally West and Jessica Cruz. The only difference is, when they revealed Deadshot in Injustice Mobile, they revealed a brand new super move, and that Deadshot super move transferred to the actual Injustice 2 game. So both games, Injustice Mobile and Injustice 2, had the exact same Deadshot super. But Jessica Cruz and Wally West's Super are not brand new. They're just copies of Green Lantern and Flash from Injustice 1. So that's kind of lessening their chances of being in Injustice 2. But again, they have character models. They have unique looks. They have somewhat of unique movesets. The only one that they don't have brand new movesets for is the Super. But I still think they have a pretty good chance of being in the game. Just because if you look at it, we haven't gotten any reveal of Green Lantern yet. And if you guys don't know, in the Injustice comics, Green Lantern Hal Jordan is now a Yellow Lantern and he's working with Sinestro and all that. So they could have Hal Jordan be in the game as a Yellow Lantern and have Jessica Cruz come in as a brand new Green Lantern, which I'll be cool for because if they have Hal Jordan as a Yellow Lantern, I'm pretty sure they will give him gear to change him back to a Green Lantern. So technically, we're going to have two Green Lanterns, which is cool because they have Superman, they can have Supergirl. Now they have Hal Jordan Green Lantern, they can have Jessica Cruz Green Lantern, or they can have Jon Stewart Green Lantern. Doesn't matter. Either way, I feel like they could have two Green Lanterns in the game. And speaking of two characters that are somewhat alike, but they can't make different, they can have Flash Barry Allen, and then they can have Wally West Flash. So it fits that whole, we got that prime, and then we got their like, lower opposite. I think it could work, and that's probably why they haven't revealed these characters yet. Because we already know the Flash Barry Allen is going to be in the game. He was in the first ever Injustice 2 trailer. We just haven't gotten anything for him yet. So here's what I'm thinking. When they actually do reveal the Flash trailer, he's going to get revealed with Captain Cold or Wally West. So there's going to be either, you know, the Flash villain and the Flash being revealed revealed as playable characters or two flashes so they can show how different the two characters actually are because yes they're both speedsters and they pretty much do the exact same thing but they can find a way to make them somewhat different. They found a way to make Superman and Supergirl different. I'm pretty sure they can find a way to make the Flash and Wally West Flash different. They did that for Shazam and Black Adam and they're pretty much exactly the same so they can do that for the two flashes and if they can do it for the two flashes, they can easily change up the moves for Jessica Cruz and whatever Green Lantern they choose. The Lanterns are probably some of the easier characters to make their movesets different because they can make constructs of different items relating to their personality. But I just wanted to make this video talking about my thoughts on possibly getting a new Green Lantern and a new Flash in the game. But let me know your thoughts down below. Do you guys think that Wally West and Jessica Cruz has a chance of showing up in Injustice 2? I'd love to hear what you guys have to say. Like the video if you guys enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. My name is Uncaged Games and... And you just got caged. Oh, Steve, you made a mistake. Steve, you made a mistake. You made a mistake, Steve. You made a mistake, Steve. <laughs> Let's go.